Okay, in this video, we're going to do the song, Come Share the Lord. We're going to learn the vocabulary of it. Now, you've probably sung this song numerous times prior to taking of the Lord's Supper. You might want to keep that in mind as you're trying to develop how you're going to present this song and what attitude your body is going to take and the signs that you're going to give. And I say this at the beginning of every single video that I start with the uh, vocabulary. It's really important that you not learn the words to the signs. That sounds strange to you. It's because we don't speak in words. But you might say, well, Mr. Lemons, I use words all the time. Uh, yeah, but you string them together in something we call sentences and phrases. We don't speak in words. If we did, that's what it would sound like. We speak in sentences. And signing is the same way. We gather here. That's not, that's words. We gather here. Okay, see the difference? They kind of run together. It's also important that you do it in phrases and sentences to help you remember how to sign the songs when you get to LTC. Because what you want to do is develop what I call muscle memory, where your hands just know what to do next. So practice that, all right? So with that said, and the preaching about that done, uh, here is the vocabulary for Come Share the Lord. We, you just point to the, your, uh, your shoulder up here, on the same side as your elbow, and then come across and point over there. That's we. That's we, that's us, that's all of us, that, you know, that's, that's what that is, all right? We. Uh, gather here in Jesus' name. Gather. This is to come, this is with, and if you move it around a bit, it's together, okay? We together here, all right? Now, what's the song saying? It's saying that we have come into this place, all right? Why? We're here in Jesus' name, okay? We gather here. All right. And it's kind of like, um, you know, you walk into a room and it's got a red floor. And they say, where's the red floor? And you go, it's right here. Okay. Here. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Okay. In. You can make a cup. And you just kind of put your fingers in the cup. Jesus. The sign for Jesus is going to be obvious. It's the center finger touching where the nails were. Name. Name. Okay? Two kind of H hands. Just kind of, don't make it a real loud car, karate chop, but just chop. Okay, that's name. His love is burning in our hearts like living flame. His. In sign language, pronouns are really, really easy. Okay? You and me. Him, all right? If there were four people in this room, it'd be you, me, he, and she. If it's possessive, it'd be mine, yours, his, hers. It's directional. So, his, possessive, directional, up. Jesus and God and the Holy Spirit live upstairs, right there, okay? Okay? His love is, oh, His love is, the letter I, coming off the chin and coming straight out. Burning in our hearts. Burning. It's like the flames, they're rising, they're rising. Burning in our, and it's open palm. It's just like we, it's like we is single finger, possessive, our, open palm, okay, our, hearts. And it's kind of the center finger, make a little circle, 
over your heart, okay? Like living flames, like living fire flames, okay? Like, it's the same here as it is here. I'll do it kind of for you can see it. Same here as it is here. Just kind of make a little circle and come back together. Like living, the letter L, start at the belt and come up to where it's most comfortable and quit. All right. Living flame and burning is the same sign. For through the loving Son, the Father makes us one. Four, kind of point to your head and just rotate your wrist. The only thing moving here is the wrist. All right. Four, <clears throat> through, live long and prosper. And then come through with palm up. If you can't live long and prosper and it's easier for you to do it that way with one finger, that's fine too. Some people are just built differently. All right. Uh, for through the loving son, now the, in sign language, we take words that are little words like the, and a, and an, and oftentimes of, and we just throw them away, okay? And that's what we're doing here, the, we're leaving the out. For through the loving, like holding on to your teddy bear, teddy bear, love, loving, lovely, lovely, all those are signed the same way, okay, love. Through the loving son, okay? It's boy coming down to be a baby kind of thing, all right? Boys is kind of like the bill of the hat. Girls is like the string of the bonnet, if you want to remember that. And in sign language, if you divide the head in half, male signs are the top half of the head, and female signs are the bottom half of the head. Half of the head. So if you have an aunt or an uncle, all right, uh, see how it, you know, Brother and sister, son, daughter. You know, it's di different side types of uh, different parts of the head. Uh, father and mother, just to name a few. All right. So through the loving son, the father, and this is sign for father. All right. But when the father is capitalized and talking about God. It is Father. It's the, the sign kind of explodes a little bit. Makes us one. Okay? Makes. And this hand is doing this, this hand is doing that, and they're doing it together on top of each other. Makes us, we all saw all that, us and we are the same thing, one. Now, we could do one as the number one, but the song really means united, okay? That's to create a little chain link here, and then link us all together, okay? Come take the bread, come drink the wine, come share the Lord. Come. It's like a wheel rolling, okay? If you have a wheel here, and it's rolling in this direction, it's coming toward you. If it's rolling that way, it's going away from you. The sign for come and the sign for go. Okay? Take the bread. Take. It's like you're trying to catch a fly out of the air. Take. Got him. All right? Take the bread. This is the loaf of the bread, and these are the slices. Come. Drink. The wine. The letter W, and you kind of circle by your cheek, because wine makes your cheeks all blushy red. Okay? Come, share, and you take a hand, your hands are like flat, and there's some for you, some for me, some for you, some for me, some for you, some. That's sharing. Okay? The Lord. And the Lord is L, starts on the shoulder, opposite the elbow. So your hand is actually across yourself, and it comes down to the hip.
think it would be? King. Q, what do you think it would be? Queen. P for princess or prince. Um, C for Christ. Okay? So it's like the, the banner of the Miss America or whatever. Uh, but it's, it's, it's titles like that. Um, so Lord, L, coming down. Lord, no one is a stranger here. No one, I right, say no one is stranger here. Okay? There's lots of ways of doing the word no. They're all spelled kind of the same way. You know, no, you can't have something. Yes, I have no uh, bananas. All right, I mean none. Uh, and anyway, so no is for negative, and no is as in I have none. No person, no one, no people. P person is a P on both hands, just kind of going down, all right? No one is a stranger here, okay? This is a sign for strange. I see that person, that person is strange, all right? And if we do this at the end of any sign, it means a person that is of the type of the sign that we just did. So a stranger, it's like adding er to the end of a word. Here, again, back to the red floor kind of thing. Everyone belongs. Every. It's an A hand with the thumb kind of sticking up there a little bit, and it comes across each of the knuckles of your other hand. Okay? Everyone, again, the people there, belongs. Okay? It's connected. We all belong with each other. Okay? Finding our forgiveness here. Finding. It's like you're looking out there and you go looking for, ooh, I got a bunch of jelly beans here. And the black ones are the best ones. So I'm going to pick that one. I like the black ones the best. Okay? So, find is the way that you know, I search through it and I find it and I pick it. Finding our, again, open palm, coming across, forgiveness here, forgiveness. It's like I have all of the things that I have against you written down here on my hand. All gone. Forgiveness here. We also, in turn, forgive all wrongs. Okay, we, in turn, also, is really the better way of saying that. We're not going to do in, in, uh, turn, or turn. Uh, we're going to do, or turn. Uh, we are going to do, also. We, also, and it's the same sign as like, out here, and then back here. Okay. Also, uh, we in turn forgive all, all is a one hand up, make a roof on it, come around and wind up, okay? You don't actually slap though, all. And really, you're twiddling your hands. All wrongs, the letter Y, and you just hit the knuckles here to your chin, okay? I don't know why that's a sign for wrong, but that, that's what it is. Okay. He joins us here. He breaks the bread. Who is he? Think about that. That's Jesus, right? Where did Jesus live? Upstairs. He joins us here. Okay. No new signs there. He breaks the bread. Okay. Breaks. It's like a pencil. You got a pencil and you go, break. Breaking a pencil. The bread. The Lord, again, no new signs here, who pours. We have an odd thing that we do in, in English. We use the word who 
interchangeably in a number of different ways. It can be a question, who are you? Or that's the guy who did something. Okay? This is really the second kind. So in sign language, though, this is a sign for who, but it's always the question. Or who, it's always the question. So instead of doing who, we want to do like the guy who did something. We point to them. It's almost like the pronoun. So the Lord who pours, it's like I've got a pitcher and I'm going to pour it. Okay. The cup, let us see on the hand, trying to make a little cup. Okay. Is risen from the dead. The Lord who pours the cup is, he's laying down, he's standing up, risen, from, it's a finger up, and you're kind of like pulling a string from it, okay? Uh, the best example, uh, visual I can think of for that is, if you saw the movie Toy Story a long time ago, Woody, uh, it was a uh, one of the little toys, and you pull a string on the back of his neck, and he would talk. Uh, there used to be dolls like that when I was a little kid. My sister had some of those. Uh, anyway, from the dead. Left hand, palm down. Right hand, palm up. And you just kind of roll them over in the grave. All right. From the dead. The one we love the most is now our gracious host. The one, okay, we're not going to make the go, we leave out the, and we're not going to do one. The one is him, right? So, the one we love the most, okay, I think we got all those signs. Most is uh, two a hands, one the right hand a little bit lower than the other, and it kind of comes up, and a little arc or in front of that. The one we love the most is now our gracious host. Is the letter I coming off the chin? Now, if make the Y hands turn them around and go down. Now, our gracious. Circle in the air, splat, welcome person. Okay, this is time for grace. This is like uh, Paul on the road to Damascus, and the light shine, and it hit him in the face. Okay, that's grace. And host is, okay, we, we, we said that if we add this to the end of a word, it makes it, a person who does that kind of thing. So, um, welcome. It's like when you open up the door and say, come on in. Welcome, host. Okay, gracious host. Come take the bread, come drink the wine, come share the Lord. Okay? We are now a family. Okay, so we and R, I think we've already gone through, R is the letter R, coming straight off the chin. Now, we did that one, a family, leave the word A out, family. It's F's, where you can kind of see through it, okay, and you kind of make a circle, and you wind up with your pinkies together, family, okay, of which, all right, now, that's kind of a pantomime, and it's a very deaf thing to do. I'm not going to say of which. I'm not even sure what that means in, in English. All right? But we are now a family. And where is that family? We just drew it. It's right here. That's where the family is, right? So, of which the Lord is head. All right, head is you point to the top of the head and point to the jawline. Got it? Though unseen, he meets us here. Doesn't matter. Not seen, he meets us here. Doesn't matter. As though not seen, unseen. 
inside this is a sign for not it's the a hand but it starts under the chin and comes out not to be confused with am which starts at the chin and comes out okay so it's under the chin not seen he Again, we're pointing up Jesus meets. This is you. This is Jesus. Oh, we meet. Okay. Us here in the breaking of the bread. Signs we already know. We'll gather soon where angels sing. Okay. We already know. Gather we'll in sign language there are no contractions all right we decontract the signs we will gather soon it's like name only you're rubbing it back and forth where angels and it's just like you're flapping your wings sing and we'll See the glory of our Lord and coming King. Okay, just like before, we'll, um, we decontract, we will see, all right, we got our eyes on the ends of our fingers, see uh, the glory. It's kind of like a little, little clap and then shimmery and my hand is, is shaking as I come off okay of our Lord and I think we know all those signs already Lord and coming King all right and we talked about King when we did Lord Lord and LK for King now okay now and I think we have already covered the sign now but thou Two Y hands with the palms up, kind of coming to an abrupt stalt, abrupt halt there. Now we anticipate. We're waiting. Wiggle your fingers at yourself. Wiggle your fingers back. Wiggle your fingers back and forth together. That's waiting. Okay. We anticipate the feast, the meal, the food, and where is it going to be? It's going to be up there, right? We're anticipating the Lord's Supper when we take it with Jesus in heaven, with our whole family, okay? Okay, so we anticipate the feast for which we wait, okay? Um, for which is, again, it's right there. It's the feast that's there, the feast over there, feast for which we wait. Um, and that's it. Okay, and then it says, come take the bread, come drink the wine, come share the Lord. All right, so let's do this. Practice this. Close your eyes and sign a sentence. Okay, look at it go. It says, we gather here in Jesus' name. We gather here in Jesus' name. All right. Then look at the next one. His love is burning in our heart like a living flame. His love is burning in our heart like living flame. Okay? Work through this line by line like that. And when you feel comfortable doing that, stretch it out to phrases, stretch it out to paragraphs, then go on to do the next video, which will be me singing it very slowly. All right? Looking forward to seeing you there at LTC. Goodbye, good luck.